People who've had sex with celebrities, how was it? I know a girl that hooks up with Hannibal Burris every time he comes to Milwaukee. Edit, they met on Bumble and she said he's very sweet guy. Back in the 2000s, a mate of mine used to F Shaggy every time he would come to Melbourne. I think he probably made 2 to 3 trips down here. We'd all make a big deal about her disappearing for a few days to shag Shaggy. She had nothing but nice things to say about him. She knew she was nothing but a bit of side poon when he was in town. Knew someone who slept with Leonardo DiCaprio. Apparently he kept his headphones on the entire time. I knew a girl who was an escort. She had sex with Derek Yetta. Afterwards he called a limo to take her home. In the limo was a gift. It was a baseball signed by Derek Yetta. Jenna Jameson kissed me on the mouth at a strip club in Ohio. That's all I got. My grandmother dated Jimmy Carter. Not sure how physical things got but I've read a few of the letters he wrote. I only post this because I can't think of any other reason I would get to bring this up. My ex slept with Till from Ramstein after a gig once many many years ago when she was a gothlet. She said he was very respectful, mildly kinky, wanted to have sex on the hotel balcony with her bent over the rail over the city so people could see, and apparently had skin as soft as a baby. Apparently he was nice, bought her breakfast the next day. Invited her back for a second sesh the next day then moved on in his tour. She said 8 out of 10 would star F again. I hooked up with Randy Newman's son. He said I had a nice vagina. I guess that's a win. I effed a chick who was in a Target catalog. It was hot. I did not sleep with but did a little more than made out with Drew Barrymore, October 2007. It was rad. Knew a girl who effed Zac Efron. Had to sign an NDA. Told me he wasn't all that great in bed, like, the fantasy was better than the reality. Still fanboyed over him hard apparently. My mom had sex with David Lee Roth. She said he smelled like sour milk and put his dirty hat on her head. A friend of mine slept with Perez Hilton. Would you be surprised if my friend said the sex wasn't very good? Edit, Perez Hilton the gossip blogger, not Paris Hilton the heiress. Too many people think I meant Paris when I wrote Perez. I remember Vanilla Rice's answer to the question, what was it like to sleep with Madonna? He said, it's not like she had a golden pussy. That has stuck with me. A woman I worked with had a one night stand with Captain Obvious, from Hotels.com, whom she met at a New York jazz club. She pretended that she didn't recognize him in order to prevent being seen as a gold digger. She was hoping to get into a short term relationship with him and hopefully he would give her some money and buy her a Lexus which she really wanted. Later she found out that he wasn't Captain Obvious, just looked very much like him. A girl I went to high school with dated Jason Ackenler, also known as Wee Man, shortly before Jackass 3 came out. He visited her family in WI around Thanksgiving time, but he hated WI so much that he paid her best friend to drive him to the airport in the middle of the night. My nana was in a serious relationship with Nash of Crosby, Stills and Nash. On a trip to Vegas, one of my friends effed Michael Jordan. She said it was painful and fairly fast. She won't ever stop talking about it. I used a gender neutral bathroom with James Franco. We made eye contact and smiled at each other when we were washing our hands. A friend of mine had sex with Paul Wesley. She said it was pretty good. He also took her on a short getaway trip. Seemed like a very nice guy. Ended up getting her a gift candle that was the scent of his cologne so she can remember him. A friend, told me Victoria Justice gave lap dances to some of his friends at a party the year she signed on for Victorious. Slept with the lady that used to do the morning news in my city this was at least 15 years ago. She is a blanket stealer and puts her cold feet right between your legs when she wants them warmed up. Now everyone knows Cassie. A friend of a friend slept with Shawn Mendes. Apparently it wasn't something to write home about. Edit. For everyone asking, the friend was a she. I know a lot of people have questioned his sexuality but it's something he's came out and said makes him feel very uncomfortable. 
a co-worker's sister slept with Chris Evans before he was famous, same town. She worked it into every conversation she could. Cos why wouldn't you? Edit, America's ass. Girl I know slept with GEZ in 2015 before he was really big, he gave her chlamydia. Friend girl of mine bang screwed an NBA player, the only detail I remember was that he was adamant about taking the condom with him when he left. Update, thank you for the award. Slept with Western Kentucky's mascot after a drunken day at Churchill Downs. She refused to keep the head on. Still 10 out of 10 experience. Yes. The big red blob thing. Friend of mine met Tiger Woods while bartending a golf charity tournament he was attending. He took her back to his hotel room and tossed her salad and had unprotected sex. This was several years before he crashed into a mailbox and divorced his wife. My sister F Drake. I walked into her room like 10 years ago and she was skyping him, I waved to him and said hi and he showed me the studio he was sitting in because I was skeptical. Pretty cool. I guess they met up after his show in the city we lived in at the time and then never spoke again. Edit. She signed a NDA. I did not. I got it on with the star of a popular 80s sitcom. She rocked my world. To protect her anonymity, I will refer to her only as B. Arthur. I slept with a well-known, now deceased, rapper when he came to Toronto a couple of times, and I stayed at his place in California for a few days as well. The sex was good but it wasn't any better than a non-celeb. He wasn't selfish in bed at all and it felt natural cause we got along. He was actually really down to earth and fun to hang out with. My mother had a one night stand with Conan back in early 2000s. They met at a bar somewhere in Texas and he bought them a hotel room. A friend slept with the lead singer of City and Color when they were touring university campuses in the early 2000s. She bragged about it to anyone who would listen. That ended a few weeks later when she realized he gave her chlamydia and genital warts. I slept with a very famous and still popular rapper from Memphis. The sex was surprisingly good. He was very attentive and affectionate. I thought he'd be arrogant, but he was cool and made sure I enjoyed myself too. I talked to a girl once outside a music venue and we got to talking about the same topic, celebrities and shit. She said her friend had sex with Atrio from the Neverending Story. They had sex on the beach somewhere in like Costa Rica. I was like that's cool, I bet he's kinda attractive as an older man. And she was like yeah he was hot, but, he gave my friend herpes. And I say, well, I guess that's her never ending story. There's this long standing rumor that while Timothy Chalamet was attending NYW, he gave a lot of people chlamydia. And with the amount of accounts from NYW students to corroborate this, I'm obliged to believe this. A celebrity I've masturbated to, liked one of my tweets once. I won't say who. Thing from Adam's family once gave me a hand job. Not really 6, or even me, but Johnny Depp asked my mom out at a bus stop around the time when he was getting famous from 21 Jump Street. I would not have been conceived if she had ghosted her BF to go on a date with Depp. My ex dated Russell Brand. And surprisingly she said he was kinky in bed but very respectful. I once had sex with Eartha Kitt in an airplane bathroom. A couple of years ago I met the frozen snowshoe. He invited me to his place and showed me his harvest rays. Everything was great but m. Um. Then he asked me to do the old King Clancy's which I politely declined. Someone I know f'd Steven Tyler, he's not very good and he's got a really tiny penis. I slept with a page 3 model once, not sure if that counts as a celebrity though. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe for more daily reddit videos.